How do you see the city's role in fostering and encouraging small businesses to locate and stay in this best place? Well, I think that I can speak to that from being on this festival downtown association and for being an active participant in it since uh, 1994. I think that we need to encourage people to be able to come into Sebastopol and spend their money here and as opposed to going to Santa Rosa. So we should encourage um, locally owned businesses that provide more of the necessities that Sebastopol residents need. I think that making, you know, and, and being in business for 23 years on Main Street, I have seen a lot of businesses come and go. So it's not easy to maintain a retail business in Sebastopol. So the, the answer, that's a complex, it's a complex problem. So it has to be solved on many, in many different directions. Um, I see this as, very tied to traffic. I think the worst thing we could, there are many small businesses in Sebastopol, many people working from their homes, doing violin lessons, therapy, small offices, you know, for this type of care. And I think we have many different kinds of businesses. That's one of the reasons why I worked for the Sebastopol Peaceful Air effort to reduce uh, lower noise pollution because it was impacting people's ability to work at home in their offices. And we did, the city council did lower its, um, you know, the decibel level. But I think traffic and, and parking is true. I, I'm against, uh, you know, something else going into the parking lot at, at uh, Hot Monk, the city on lot, because I think we need to continue to sustain the parking that we have um, and, and really allow traffic to, you know, to move and circulate. If people decide, look, it's an extra 15 minutes of traffic coming back from Santa Rosa, where all so many people are, to get into Sebastopol, they're gonna stay and see a therapist or you know, go to a store there, and that's, or go to a farmer's market there, and that would be terrible. So, uh, traffic and, um, you know, and, and, and allowing people to move easily. Thanks. Well, we continue to brand that we are the small business center. Uh, we continue to expand on that. How do we foster and encourage small businesses to locate and stay here? We connect the Barlow with the downtown. We really make it one downtown. We expand the downtown district. We work to use that expanded district to create and can fund an economic developer position for the city. So instead of everybody working their tails off to make that happen, we can have the forward thinking vision required to really move into this new economy that is so important. We need jitney services. We need to use the bus we already have. There's a local bus and it goes around. The more of us ride it, they'll start bringing more. I love the idea of an electric trolley going from the top of town to the, the you know, fur crest, back up to the Pacific. Market taking you to the center and you, you hop on. You know, open air, electrified, you know, really inviting people to come. You come to Sebastopol, I hope you're coming to stay because this is not a thoroughfare. I'm not interested in getting you through fast in your car. You park, you get out, you have fun. You park once, you stay a while. You walk, you, you bring your bike, you know, park on the edge, ride your bike around town. That's what we do for small businesses. We stand up for them and we build the local sustainable infrastructure to support them. Thank you. So I've been hearing talks too about um, an economic development person that could help, even if it started out as a part-time position, to um, reach out to people. I think people go where they're invited. So. Um, you know, I, I was talking to somebody about the, in my research saying, why didn't we get Amy's? And, and, and I know it's nothing's a simple answer, and I wasn't part of the process, but I would have loved to have seen my son eating at Amy's instead of eating at Taco Bell, so, um, or Burger King. So, you know, when businesses want to come to town, when they're interested, um, it would be great to have a position within the city of someone that would reach out to them and could kind of help them through the process that is Sebastopol and invite them to come. Um, and so uh, that's just an idea. Um, but I, I think we want to be encouraging the right kind of business to our downtown community.